Hello and thank you for watching this video. On this video, I will show you how to use AliExpress shipping methods and costs using the plugin Ushark Roll Express. Once you have the plugin installed and configured correctly, what you need to do is the following. There are three steps that you need to do in order to use the AliExpress shipping methods. The first step is to use is to import one product using the plugin. The second step is setting the configuration to use the AliExpress shipping methods and the last step is to simulate the behavior of an end user who wants to place an order on your shop. So to do this I will do the following. I will import random products from here. So I will search for product iPhone for example. I will wait for the result to be displayed below. Okay, I will pick just random product. I will pick this one. I will open the customization model and then I will confirm the import. So I will not customize the product, I will just import it. And this will take some seconds and I will see a notification here below. Okay, the product has been asserted successfully. Then, I, I, let's go and check if the product is there. The product is inserted 10 seconds ago and it's there and it's in stock. Okay, everything is good. Second thing to do is to set the configuration. So you go to the tab configuration, you go to the end of the page, bottom of the page, and then you select this option here and you save configuration. Everything is fine, everything is done. The last step is to place an order and see if this is working fine. So I will I will try to simulate an end user behavior. So I will open a page and I will select some options here and add the product to the cart. Then I will go to the view cart and see how many if this is used correctly or not. Okay, I can see that there is DHL delivery the delivery date will be the 3-11-2020 and it costs 76 euro. I'll try to change address. So I will go back a little bit. No, I'll try actually to update the address here to see if there are some other shipping methods. And I will try to open the product also to see if there is any other shipping method. So I'll try to change this to USA, English, and United States. Okay, that's fine. I'll see if here there are... Okay, there is only DHL. So I see the only possible options to deliver to United States. And it costs 76 euro which is the same here. I will try to import another product to see if we have more shipping options. So I will search for Samsung for example and I will pick the first product here, add waiting list. So you can import either by customizing product or by adding it directly to the waiting list. I will import the product. I will clear my shipping cart. So the product has been added successfully. I'll go to the list of product again. I open the product page like what the customer normally should do. And I will open also the original product URL to check if there is any. Okay, let's see. We have four shipping options. Let's see if you have the same here. So I will choose option white and from China here and I will add this to the shopping cart. I will view this and I see that there are four options. So the first option is Kainao Super Economy, ePackets, another Kainao Super Economy and standard shipping delivery. So this one is free, this one is two, this one is free and this one is five. 36. So this is how the shipping methods work using the plugin Wushark for AliExpress. You will not need to, to worry about anything. This is, will be done automatically. You just need to import the product and set the option and that's all. The, product, the user can choose which 
shipping method you want to use and you will be charged for that. We are up to the end of this video. Don't forget to subscribe and like the video and subscribe to our channel. Thank you again and see you on next video.